GEO, I would like to take the opportunity to express our support to this multilateral assessment process in promoting the comparability of effort along all developed parties in regard to their emission reduction targets. The Republic of Bulgaria is situated on the Eastern Balkan Peninsula in southeastern Europe, along the Black Sea, with a territory around 111,000 square kilometers. The neighbor states are Greece and Turkey to the south, Republic of North Macedonia and Serbia to the east, the river Danube separates it from Romania to the north, and its natural eastern border is the Black Sea. The population of Bulgaria is around 6,447,710. Bulgaria joined the EU in 1st January 2007. GDP per capita in 2021 was 12,475 euro. Unemployment rate is 5.4%. Under the UNFCCC, the EU and its member states has joined pledge under the Convention and it is unconditional quantified economic-wide emission reduction target of 20% by, by 2020 compared to 1990 levels. Joint commitments to the EU and its member states, Iceland and UK, has a binding commitments under the Kyoto Protocol to reduce average annual emissions during 2030-2020 by 20% compared to 1990. Under the Paris Agreement, the EU and its member states are committed to a binding target of an at least 55% emission reduction in greenhouse gas emissions by 2030 compared to 1990. The EU quantified economic wide emission reduction target is implemented through the EU Climate and Energy Package. The package underpins the EU implementation of the target under the Convention. The package introduces a clear approach to achieve a 20% reduction of the total greenhouse gas emissions for 1990 levels. A reduction objective is divided between the EU ETS scheme and the effort sharing regulation sectors. The EU ETS set the EU wide cap based on the harmonized rules, and the target is minus 21% compared to 2005. There is no individual national target here. The EU target for non ETS sectors is minus 10% in 2020 compared to 2005 levels. Bulgaria target for non-ETS sector is maximum 20% in 2020 compared to 2005 levels. Bulgaria fulfilled the compliance with the target until 2020. The EU target for renewable energy in gross final energy consumption in 2020 is 20%. The national binding target is 60%. Bulgaria overachieved the target and shared the renewable energy in gross final energy consumption in 2020 is to 23.3%. Non-binding 20% uh, EU wide energy efficient target, Bulgaria fulfilled by 2091.2% of the country's total cumulative energy savings target. The 2020 targets have been overachieved by the EU. This means that the EU in its member state jointly met their target by implementing the 2020 EU Climate and Energy Package.
Contribution of the sectors between based year and 2021 shows that in the based year, the largest fraction in emissions among the sector belongs to the energy, 72%, followed by agriculture accounts for 11, 12% of total greenhouse gas emissions, industrial processes are, is 11%, and waste 5%. In 2021, the largest fraction in green emissions along the sectors without blue is red belongs to the energy sector, 75%, agriculture with 11%, of, uh, industrial processes is 9%, and waste is 5%. The present information of the climate change uh, mitigation legislations aims to describe the existing legal mechanisms and to indicate how the measures related to the different sectors are legally regulated. The mitigation uh, legislations are mainly Climate Change Mitigation Act, Energy Act, Renewable Energy Act and Energy Efficiency Act. The new strategic documents in the climate field are Integrated National Energy and Climate Plan for the period 2021-2030, National Recovery and Resilience Plan of the Republic of Bulgaria, National Adaptation Strategy and Action Plan until 2030, Long-Term Strategy of Republic of Bulgaria until 2050. The key national policy measures in the different sectors set in the third national action plan on climate change that lead to a reduction of greenhouse gas emissions with the result of achievement of the 2020 targets are in the energy and manufacturing industry, industries policy and measures are mainly modernization and decentralization of energy and heat generation, transition to low carbon electricity mix, development of low carbon networks for transmission and distribution of electricity, increasing energy efficiency and use of renewable energy sources, improvements of energy efficiency through conducted energy audits of companies, the use of alternative, of, of alternative fuels in the combustion units of industrial installation, the UETS scheme. In agriculture and rural CF sector, the policy measures a uh, reduction of greenhouse gas emissions from agriculture and by encouraging the suitable rotation of crops, management of degraded agriculture and land through biological reclamation and implementation of erosion control measures, improving the management of manure by introduction of low carbon practices, increasing carbon dioxide sequestration, preservation of carbon stocks in forest, and long-term capture storage in wood products. Bulgaria's total greenhouse gas emissions, in excluding Belusiev, are projected under the VEMS scenario to decrease by 48.4 and 49.2% respectively below the 1919 level in 2030 and 2035. Under the VEMS scenario, Total greenhouse gas emissions, excluding Lulusiev in 2030-2035, are projected to be lower than those in 1990 by 49.7 and 51.5% respectively. In conclusions, I would like to underline that Bulgaria met its 2020 commitment under the Convention through its contribution to achieving the joint target of the EU. 
Bulgaria met also greenhouse gas reduction targets within the EU by 2020, and we will continue our efforts to reach 2020 targets for greenhouse gas emission reduction and climate neutrality until 2050.